Hey guys, it's Spidey. Um, so, we're back. Um, doing more, you know, coal mining where we left off. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's still even the same vein. I think, like I've mentioned in my first episode, I really just kind of want to keep this, like, what I do, you see. Um, I really am going to try to do as minimum off-camera as possible because it's already going to be really hard for me to do these YouTube videos. So... Um, I figure if I just show you guys everything, it would help me a lot as well. Now, if the response from doing this, doing it this way is not very high, either, you know, I'll be releasing even less frequently than I do now, or, you know, I might have to figure out something else. Plus, the other thing is I just don't really have good, uh software right now or should I say I can't afford good video editing software right now so for me it's just a lot easier to do it this way which is pretty much record and what you guys when I start recording to when I start recording that's exactly what you guys see there is no editing involved as of right now not that I would mind it or anything just this is more of a hobby and if my hobby starts to stress me out then that you know <laughs> but I want to appease you people peas appease all yous out there anyway um, yeah so we're still in this cave system here just want to gather all these resources possibly go drop them off or maybe I'll just quickly make a chest here um, but actually what I would like to do is make an iron pick first on the off chance that we find some goody goodies that um, cannot be mined with stone. Because we're getting a fair amount of iron, so, and there's some goodness. Like, this is a pretty huge case system down here. I imagine they all kind of connect. Um, but like this ravine and all this stuff is just going to be a real fun time to explore, so actually possibly maybe I could do a little bit now. Let's see here. Let's hope that this is not a mistake. More iron. These just it just branches off and branches off. However, all these resources are just so nice. Gosh, I love creepers because they just love to sneak up on me. And I cannot always hear them, so it's real lovely times. I mean, you guys saw it. I think in like the first episode, I had like a little encounter and no big deal. I handed it like a professional. You know me. <laughs> oh, God. <clears throat> so we had the 4th of July yesterday. It was a lot of fun. I always go to my friend's house for the 4th. Um, it's just been our tradition for like the past 15 years. And... Uh, her dad just goes nuts, like, getting all these crazy fireworks, and it's it's a great show. <clears throat> Excuse me. We're going to be set here for a while with the amount of stuff that we're getting out of these cave systems. I mean, look at this. Iron, iron. I mean, it's everywhere. It's wow, that's pretty cool. Coal everywhere. Okay, let's um, before we get too enamored with this place, aka before I get lost in this place. as I start digging for more resources. I mean, this is me right here. This is...
just resource gathering. This is actually one of my favorite things in the game for some reason. I don't know why. It's just something mellow you can kind of do. You don't really require much thought. I know come build time, I'm going to have a real hard time, like, trying to keep talking to you guys. Um, while paying attention to what I'm saying. So, but I mean, you know, I'm excited. It should be a fun little challenge. Not something you do every day. I'm excited to go exploring this little cave system, but at the same time, I'm slightly terrified because I get lost so easily. I remember the first... Li oh my gosh, it's getting dark. Okay. I remember the first live stream I ever did. I just got so lost. It was two hour long lost. Um, and it was ridiculous. I mean... It was crazy. Two hours. People in stream were just having a, a, a hoot nanny with... <laughs> laughing at me and I mean I don't really blame them I guess you know the whole time they were like we knew exactly where you were and I'm thinking of course you did of course you did yeah it is what it is yeah let's sleep I tried to avoid mobs as much as possible as you can probably tell um There's coal right out here. I didn't even get this. That that seems slightly silly of me. I'm traveling great lengths to get coal, and it's right outside my door. I don't remember like the cave system being like this. I just haven't played, I guess, in so long. So for those of you that are from America, I hope you guys enjoyed your fourth. Like I said, I enjoyed mine. I really enjoy being with family and friends and that kind of thing. It's really, it's, it's surprising because the fourth is probably one of my only um, holidays that I actually have some kind of a tradition for, with the exception of Christmas. But like, I don't have a pr I don't have like a routine Thanksgiving or a routine Easter or anything like that. So and it's not like I'm a, I'm with my family necessarily on the fourth. I'm with my you know my best friend's family who's I've known almost my whole life. So they are kind of my second family. But enough of that. Back to Minecraft. <laughs> Oh, did not want to fall that far, but. Ooh, look at how cool this is. I think this is. Oh, that's just like a, that looks really cool. I like it. So this one apparently branches off just as much as all the other ones that we've come across as far as caves and stuff go. These just all have to connect somewhere at some kind of a base level I'd imagine because this is just there's so many of these things and they just branch off and branch off.
Okay, I just wanted to make it safe up there, then all of a sudden I just got distracted again. Do you see? Oh, man. Yeah, this part of it is probably not the most exciting thing to watch, you know, just me getting all these resources, but there, I just feel like there's so many of them here, why not get them? Oh, that was stupid. Um, why not get them now? When they're so accessible? Because when we start journeying off to see the different biomes that are close to us, you know, resources are good to have. Although what I could do, though, is maybe I'll do a little bit of exploring next episode. Um, and just kind of, you know, write down the coordinates to this particular area and just keep this as, like, a base that I'll probably never visit. But, you know, keep it in my back pocket for if I ever need to come to a caving system again or whatever. I'm sure that this whole world seed... It's going to be epic everywhere. I mean, look at all this. I mean, it's ridiculous. I have I don't know if I've ever experienced a world where there's this insane amount of iron just waiting. Like on the surface like this. I've usually had to do some kind of strip mining or whatever. Um, but holy smokes, this is just... Iron and coal galore. I hope the diamonds are this easy to find. Because that would be super nice. Very nice. I have been tempted to get some kind of like a mini-map mod or something like that. But... I'm just so partial to just playing, like, vanilla that I don't, I don't know. I don't know if I could ever do it. I don't know. Maybe one day. I also feel like if you start playing too much with the mods, though, oh, excuse me, that come, I don't know, for whatever reason, like, going back to vanilla would just not be right. So it kind of... Like, basically, once you go mod, you never go back. <laughs> kind of a thing, I guess, is what I'm trying to say in 17 words or more. <laughs> All right, let's go back to the surface. Somewhere. Gosh, holy jollies. I thought maybe that would be the easier way to go. I do not like gravel. <laughs> yeah, but it is about to get... Well, I don't know how dark it's about to get. But... I feel like we've done this enough. And... I'm lost. <laughs> now nah, here I am. I should have just con continued. Oh jeez, let's just let's just stick to the surface entrance that I know and love, which is clearly not here. Oh gosh. Uh, well, it's like right down here, isn't it? There it is. All right, I just. It's misunder, misunderestimated. <laughs> misunderestimated. Oh, I'm so silly. I'm so silly. All right. Well, we've got a pretty good haul of stuff here, I must say. Um, I don't know why I wouldn't put two full. Never mind. Um, yeah, it's looking pretty good so far. We have, wow, we have a, almost a stack of iron already. That's pretty crazy. Actually, we do have a... 30, 50, okay. Yep, we're short, about eight. But nonetheless, I think it's that time, guys. Um, so once again, thanks for watching. Um, 
And next time I'm going to do a little bit more exploring. I, you guys are probably tired of the resource gathering, so next time we'll do a little bit more exploring and try to find our new home. So thank you so much for watching. You guys have a fabulous day or night or wherever you are, and I will talk to you later. Bye.